Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a highly requested permanent snow flocking DIY for your Christmas tree. I got this off of Amazon and if you're interested in how I did this myself, stay tuned. All right, you guys, I am so excited to be bringing this DIY to you today. I am in love with the flocked Christmas tree look, but I wasn't in love with the price tag that came along with it. Most of the ones that I really loved were right around five, six hundred dollars. Um, I need about a nine and a half foot tree for my house because I do have 14 foot ceilings and I need something to fill out that space. Now, I do have a Hobby Lobby tree. Um, that I actually bought off the marketplace on Facebook a couple of years ago when I moved into my house and um, I was lucky enough to get it for about a hundred dollars and I took my hundred dollar tree and I added the forty dollar snow bond Amazon flocking or flocking from Amazon and transformed my tree into my dream tree. I am absolutely floored with how this turned out. This is a permanent flocking. Uh, with any kind of flocked tree, there will be maintenance throughout the years, just kind of touching it up neat as need be. Um, but for the most part, um, it is very low shedding and should be permanent. But I'm honestly, you guys, I am blown away by the results. So just keep on watching and see how I go through this and I will walk you guys through everything that I did to prep my tree and how I got it flocked. So I bought a five pound bag of the Snow Bond. I will have it linked down below for you guys. And as you can see here in the clip, I'm sprinkling it on by hand. Um, the instructions say to use a sifter, like a flour sifter. But actually, when I read the reviews, they said that the application was thicker and better if you applied it with your hands. And then, of course, I'm coming from an upwards motion, um, just like how snow would fall. And you'll see that I'm spraying it at the same time. I'm actually just spraying it with water per the instructions. And you don't want to wet down your tree first. You actually want to be spraying it as it falls. So you want to be applying this to the snow as it's falling and then once you're done you will just seal it with a final spray um, but this was very very easy to apply and you can do it as light or as heavy as you want um, for the look that you're going for but I again I'm blown away by how amazing this flocking is and how incredible the transformation was. I do just want to add as well that you want to be wearing clothes that you don't mind getting a little dirty so you'll see I'm kind of wearing some grungy clothes in this video and that is because I didn't want to get any of my nice clothes all sticky and full of snow bond but again I will have this linked down below for you guys but I hope you enjoy the rest of this application. And if you have any questions for me, feel free to leave them in the comments below and I will get back to you.
in this part of the video I am mostly sealing um, the flock that I have already put down so you can see I'm spraying quite a bit of water um, that is to seal the flock on the tree and you do want to let this dry for about 72 hours before you bring it inside and also forgot to mention that you should be doing this in a little to no wind area um, but after 72 hours you should be good to go to bring it inside. So this is the final result you guys. I do not have my tree lit because with pre-lit trees and after you've had it for a few years, some of the strands do tend to go out. So I need to go and pick up probably some battery operated strands um, just so that I can stick some in there. Um, but yeah, it is pretty much shed free and I am absolutely in love with the end result. you guys that is going to wrap it up for this video if you liked this DIY flocking video please be sure to give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel before you leave I've got lots of other really fun videos planned for you guys this holiday season and I will see you guys in a couple days for another really fun video okay bye you guys